People were injured, one critically, in an attack at Ohio State University this morning. Investigators say a student ran his car into a crowd on campus, then started stabbing people. The attacker was shot and killed by police. Now, during the height of this emergency, the school sent out this alert telling students to run, hide, fight. It is a mantra that originated right here in Houston. Phil Archer live tonight with that video that the city of Houston made with the Department of Homeland Security. Phil? That's right. That simple instruction went out to all 65,000 Ohio State students this morning while the attack was happening. It's a catchphrase that conveys a strategy developed here in Houston a few years ago by the Mayor's Office of Homeland Security. Just after that 18-year-old Ohio State student drove his car into fellow students, then attacked them with a knife, the school sent out this tweet warning all students that an active shooter was on campus, advising them to run, hide, or fight. It was scary. It was really scary. We barricaded ourselves in our, in our rooms like we were taught, turned off our lights, um, and just hunkered down. Run, hide, fight is a strategy devised by the city of Houston in 2012 to teach average citizens how to protect themselves. So OSU actually worked with us a couple years ago in uh, developing their own run, hide, fight uh, video. <laughs> The video produced by the city with the Department of Homeland Security has become a standard training aid nationally. The Houston video has been translated into six languages, the English language version garnering more than five million views on YouTube so far. The Harris County Department of Education has held several training sessions for run, hide, fight. The department was hosting a workshop on active shooter strategies when word of the Ohio State incident came down. It actually adds an urgency to the need for them to go back to the organizations and make sure that they're prepared. That original video is still on YouTube. You can find a link to it on our website, Click to Houston. There's also a link there for the Department of Homeland Security's active shooter preparedness site. Reporting live in Northeast Houston, I'm Phil Archer, KPRC Channel 2 News. Thank you.